St. Leo Lions volleyball season ended with a feeling of disappointment, as this was the first time in five years that we did not make the NCAA tournament. Our overall record was 15-14 and and a staggering 4-10 and on the road. The Lions finished tied for 6th with a 9-7 and Sunshine State Conference record. We were 8th in the NCAA South Region. Unfortunately, we missed the NCAA tournament by one conference win or it went over North Alabama. The team was second overall in blocking and opponent hitting percentage in the Sunshine State Conference. The individual accolades for the Lions was the least in four years as well. Out of the 22 SSC All-Conference nominations, we only received two. Bruno Rocha and Daniel Bledsoe were selected. Out of the six people to make the All-SSC All-Freshman team, Jacqueline Miloto, our setter, was selected. Our biggest award went to Danielle Bledsoe, who was named the NCAA All-South Region Team for her third straight season. The Lions are working hard this spring as we lost four great seniors and three transfers. Despite these losses, we had a great win over the University of South Florida two weeks ago. We have five great recruits coming in, so we are excited for the fall season. We will be back in the SSC battle next year. Now I would like to talk about my five seniors. First, Emily Calderon tore her Achilles tendon on the second day of preseason. She is a three-time All-American and the best passer I've ever coached. The exciting news is that she has decided to redshirt and play next fall. Kim Knuckles is a great story as she came to St. Leo as a marginal student and a solid volleyball player. Now she is leaving as a strong student with a degree in marketing. Kim has been a starter during all four years at Leo. Even the game she did not start, she was the perfect player off the bench. Kim thought about going home twice in her career, but we are so happy that she stuck it out and will graduate as a Lion. Leah Perry will graduate with a degree in elementary education. She was a four-year starter as well. Leah is the best right side blocker to ever play here. She is third all-time in block assists and fourth all-time in total blocks. She is sixth all-time in games played. Leah has a huge heart and is going to be a great elementary school teacher and volleyball coach one day. Bruna Rocha came to us as a junior college transfer. She will graduate with a degree in international business. You will not see Bruna's name on the all-time record list due to her short two years here. However, she is the best outside hitter to play for me at St. Leo. In two years, she had 650 kills, which would be second all-time if she played here for four years. She had 772 digs, which would be first all-time. Bruna is a perfect example of how an international player can come and change her program instantly. She is a great person and we will miss her greatly. Lastly, my captain and leader of this team for four years is Caitlin McKenna. I know I have listed best blocker, best outside hitter, and best passer, but Caitlin's title is one that we hope our players will achieve. This is the best student athlete I have ever, ever, ever coached. She has been on the President's Club all seven semesters and probably eight after this month. She will graduate in a difficult field of accounting with high honors. Now the volleyball side. Caitlin is first all-time in attack percentage, second in kills, second in games played, second in total blocks, first in block assists, and the stats go on and on. She is a three-time All-American and only the second player to ever wear a Lions jersey to accomplish that goal. Caitlin is a family person, a leader, a student, an athlete, and most importantly, a great example of someone who utilizes her gifts from God. We will miss her so much. Before I conclude, I would like to thank my assistant coaches, Lauren and Carlos. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for all that you do for me and our players. Take care and God bless.